Good evening, and welcome back to Enter the Gungeon. It's been almost two weeks since I last played. First I went away for a week, and then when I came back my Vive arrived, which is pretty awesome, but obviously caused a bit of a distraction. However, I've been looking forward to getting back into this game, so here we go. I have probably managed to lose all benefit of the experience of playing it before. So I'll probably suck just as much as I did that. Pew pew pew! I also noticed on that title screen that it had a version number, 1.0.6. Um, I don't know whether it had one, whether it had that before. I'm not sure what uh, version it was the last time I was playing. But then it's not like I really knew that much about the game anyway, so... Oh, no prior knowledge is likely to be invalidated. Question, did that purple thing hit me before? And did it do damage? Because I only seem to have taken one thing of damage. I knew that was going to actually get hit by a bullet or something. Oh, I mean, uh, uh, but I mean, it's actually projectile, not the projectile. It's okay, I'm just getting back into it. Zoom out. Remember that I've got a roll, and I should probably use it. I feel like I should have picked one of the. Oh, for sake. Thank you, health piece. Is this actually corresponding to the door? Saying that the next thing is gonna be... Yeah, I don't to manually reloading, apart from not being caught with your pants down. If you suddenly find you need to reload in the middle of a... Oh jeez. Just my mouse on the mouse pad. Please. I assume I get cash for flipping. 
How do I, how do I check this? I forgot the button. Table tech money. This ancient technique produces money whenever a table is flipped and flips all unflipped tables in the room. Huh. So helpful. Oh, uh, I can. Neat. Very convenient. Unfinished gun, still warm. This gun is still in the process of being forged. It barely functions in its current state, but could be a viable choice in a truly desperate situation. A small hourglass is embossed on the cylinder. say it's more accurate than my other gun, but now I'm not so sure. Still, I am happy to have another gun. Do those bullets change? based on distance. Are they getting smaller? Mm. Break all the things. I still don't know if there's anything for me to do in that room, so I shall leave it. an eagle. Key seems very useful. Something for the collection? I will compensate you. Smiley, smiley. Um... I wouldn't know how to... Before I end up shooting and doing something really bad. Let's see if I can remember what my keys are. Q is use blank. I'd forgotten about that one. In fact, I was about to push it. Drop gun. Is that a thing I can do here? That was less than helpful. Wait, what did I get for that? I think I, I got cash, didn't I? Or currency. If I had a bit more... I don't think I've picked up the Dungeon Eagle before. So worth it just to try it at least. Dungeon Eagle. A powerful, unwieldy handgun can be charged for more power. Neat. Massive damage, not terribly accurate. Mm. I tend to prefer accuracy in my guns. Uh, I kind of wish I could pick up the key as well. I 
are fighting. Nothing. I don't think I've seen these guys. Double tap trigger twins. Have I seen them? something I can do with them. And a new gun. Hexagon. Light fantastic. <clears throat> can transmogrify foes. The hexagon was created by a vengeful Gundra after his apprentices were slain by a Gunjaneer wielding the humble bundle of wands. The stock is formed from what was once his staff, and each piece of metal was enchanted thrice before assembly. His revenge came swiftly, and from a great distance. 82 ammo. I forgot to check whether I got any... Uh, whether the killing boss gave me any currency. Doesn't matter. Oh, I'm knocking them off anyway. The convenient. Oh my god. Probably should have done that earlier. Keep from rescuing Mistress Cadence and this one. I will escort her to the breach. Come on, Ox. Ugh, you're always so slow. Oh, finally. I knew it would be a while before someone came down here, but seriously? It's been forever. Anyway, we should get back to the shop. It's been closed for way too long. You should come by. We're on the top level of the breach. You can't miss it. Andy. I hope that's all I needed to do. Good. Okay, I guess that counts as done or whatever. What's this?
got what's this? Uh, this is armor. Mm. Mm. Fine. I do really like the other gun though. I don't think I've flipped a single table. Particularly the right now. Oh, that's bad. Oh, yeah, so, not a fan. Checking this thing again. Produces money whenever a table is flipped. Explosions! More explosions! Chicken. Oh, what? I just put it. Well, walked into it. What are you? the reload state of this. Reload it. Okay. There's nothing else in here. I don't know if you could hear that. That was just my wrist. And my thumb. Keys would be good. Heart health would be good. Prime primer is not affordable. I'm still maxed out on blanks because I keep forgetting to use them. Version of lead skin seems pretty useful. I'm gonna go ahead and health up. I'll grab an extra key. I feel like that might not have been the best <clears throat> the best use of my cash.
Here's the boss. Five. Yep. Almost like everywhere. that look like sharks. No, not bosses. Normal enemies. Um, bullet sharks. Okay. <clears throat> Keep pushing E. Would I be saving keys if I tried to pick first? Or does it make it so that you. Is there a chance that it will break if you try to pick it and then you won't be able to use a key? Barrel. Nothing easier semi automatic. Even mentioning guns in the gungeon can have strange effects. This is an old idiom that has been given physical form through simple repetition. Note, words are the Gungeon's <laughs> second language, so slight inaccuracies may occur. Uh, is that a fish? Yep. Did the first one shoot a fish? Like shooting fish in a barrel. Time for the next boss. Ah, we meet again. I'm pretty sure that you killed me the last time, just before I had the last time I played. Nope. So many things. Wait, where are those other when you panic. Ah, success. Trick, trick gun. Reload to transform. Alternates between handgun and shotgun forms. That's pretty cool, I think. Okay, I can't reload it when it's full. Oh wait, am I using it? Yeah, it is. Right now. And now it's shotgun. Blam! Okay, that's, that's cool. Black Powder Mine, Chamber 3. I believe... 
does this, but I couldn't. I certainly don't remember this. Oh, background at all. I don't know what was bouncing around so fast just before. But I did not like it. Not one bit. Oh! Oh, there is. Oh, well, those dudes mine that were bouncing around before. Can I get in this? Oh, I can. This guy reminded me of a secret of mana enemy as well for some reason. Little wolf plant guys. I think that's what they were called. They float around and they always showed up. In the um, in the ruins, uh, like um, there is. I'm not sure why. Oh, whoops. I mean, I'm not sure why he reminded me beyond just a very vague sharing of the attribute of being floating. But Yes, roll, that's the thing. And I should do it. Do I need to pick up these currency? They aren't going to disappear if I take too long to like, clear the room or anything, are they? <laughs> I was afraid that for some reason I had to take the um, the cart, and that was walking across the rail was no problem. Oh, I walked into that like some kind of number. Oh, terrible! Well, it's an improvement. I am happy, and I unlocked a thing. Um, I might actually go there now, just for a quick look-see. Uh, no, this was the tutorial thing. One's brought it up. Greeting. This is the Gundren Acquisitions Department. Okay, so I can donate the green things. And we'll order new guns and items for the collection. It can be hard to come by here in the Gundren, but since the Hmon took over, that's all anyone on the outside uses. regarding asking about the collection. Yeah, the Gungeon is like a reliquary or some kind of museum, only for guns. So we are collecting all the best ones and then throwing them downstairs. Luckily, the H1 has to put rebels down pretty regularly, so we've got a constant supply of new equipment. They'll sell us anything. 
Once they're ordered, you can find the new stuff down in the chambers. Cool, so this is how I unlock new stuff. Acquisitions department is once again operational. What do we have? How many do I... Okay, so I've got ten. nothing. Oh, that just shows the thing I'm looking at. Rocket-powered bullets. Hmm. I've got ten. Let's spend them now. Let me get myself an RPG. Should I go for the most expensive things? Five. Three, there are two. Gamma ray. Yeah. I'm gonna go with the carbine. And the gamma ray. And that's me spent. And that's going to be it for this episode. Uh, thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time.